Refreshing Stories. Hi, I'm Hiroshi. I'm a salesman working at Skato Corp. My sales performance is neither good nor bad. But for some reason, my colleagues often ask me to do odd jobs. And before I knew it, I'm treated like a handyman. How's the document I asked you to do? Oh, I finished it, so I left it on the desk there. Oh, is it this? Thanks! Did you reply to my customer's email? Did that first thing in the morning. You're so quick with everything, but you're still doing odd jobs. Like that, I know that my coworkers use me for their convenience. But since I'm not interested in getting promoted, I really don't care. You're still doing odd jobs, Mr. Ohira? Well, since you don't have any skills whatsoever, this suits you. Continue working hard for everyone, okay? Don't get involved in important work, because I know you'll mess up. This is Mr. Kakuta, the HR manager. Every time he sees me, he makes sarcastic comments. All right, the CEO's daughter will come here next week, and will be working with us, so please, be polite, everyone. Hey, Mr. Ohira, I'll have you take care of her odd jobs, okay? Thanks. What? I need to do that too? Shut your mouth! Incompetent people like you only need to do odd jobs! Uh, okay, I'll do it. A week later. This is Kyoka Shindo, who will be working with us from today. Be nice to her, everyone. Could we get a quick comment from you? Hi, I'm Kyoko Shindo. I'll be training employees, but I can't wait to work with you all. Don't make her have a hard time. If you have any odd jobs, please feel free to use this most incompetent man in this company, Mr. Ohira. Um, okay. Nice to meet you. Oh, uh, nice to meet you too. She's a very hard-working woman. And since she came to the company, she steadily achieved results. About this document, the estimate is too low. To be honest, reconsider it. Yes, ma'am! You're doing poorly this month. Your sales method might be the problem. So I'll accompany you next time, okay? Th thank you. Miss Shindo has been receiving a lot of praise from everyone. On the other hand, I'm still being asked to do odd jobs every day, like making photocopies and making coffee. I finished photocopying the documents you asked for. Thank you. Mr. Ohira, you're always forced to do odd jobs, but don't you have any professional pride? <laughs> not really. I'm not interested in getting promoted, so I'm okay with it now. Instead, I'll perfectly do the job I'm asked for. So it's perfect, right? What the hell? People like you will ruin the company. I'll go tell my dad to fire you. I don't know what you're saying. Wait, is it really that easy to get someone fired? <laughs> Such a good idea to fire him. If he messes up next time, let's tell the CEO and get him fired. I know this is unreasonable, but these two people began to keep an eye on me. But I've never made a huge mistake at work, so I didn't care about this at all. A few days later... Did you check the client's list? Also, the estimate is incomplete, so check that. You gather the documents and go meet the customer. I'm sure it will go well, so good luck! She continued to achieve results and started managing the sales department. Because of that, she was left with an enormous amount of work to do. Mr. Ohira, I need a little help with my work. Can you put together this proposal? Huh? The proposal? Y yes this but I wonder if you can come up with a decent plan, since you're always doing odd jobs. All I need to do is come up with a plan and write a proposal, right? Sure. I'll be responsible for doing what I'm told until the end. Hey, hold on! Are you really okay with leaving everything up to him? He's an idiot who can't do anything! I bet he'll think about something ridiculous! Yeah, I'm very busy, so I'll take any help I can get. Besides, I've already asked, and I'll fix it later, so don't worry. Wait. Hold on a minute. If he submits a messed up proposal, wouldn't it be a good idea to fire him for that reason? Yes! I can finally get rid of that incompetent stupid-ass guy! The next day... Uh... I finished the proposal you asked me to do. What? Already? Are you serious? Can you show me it? Hey, wait! Stop lying! Isn't it a little too fast? Please don't tell me that you made it randomly! What? Of course not! I gave it my all! I perfectly do the job I'm asked to do. Yeah? And I bet it sucks. Huh? So, how's this incompetent guy's proposal? I it's... wow! Right? I mean, it's something that he came up with, so... I know that it really... what? Wow. Mr. Ohira, oh my god, what are you? This proposal is perfect in every way. What? 
They can't be! Can I see it too? This is... Wow. This is very well made. See? I told you that it's perfect. This is so amazing, Mr. Ohira! I've never seen anything like this before! Also, the fact that you made it this quick! I'm not used to receiving compliments, so... I don't know what to say. My policy is to do exactly what I'm told. Whether it's just photocopying or proposal. What's wrong with you, Mr. Kakuta? Why are you treating this brilliant man like shit? Oh, uh, he's a lazy employee who can only do odd jobs! Do you think a person like that would make something perfect? Seriously? Uh, Miss Shindo, please, wait! Oh, there he goes. Uh, wasn't she, like, pissed off? Uh, is she telling the CEO? Crap! Hey, Dad! Mr. Ohira from my department is a very competent employee, but he has been treated like crap for a long time! Mr. Kakuta? I heard from some- Not even that! A genius! Mr. Ohira over there is competent. What's your evaluation of him? Aren't you the HR manager? Is it okay for someone in a position to fairly evaluate employees to make that- Then, all the employees were gathered. Not like that? What do you mean? Yes. Very in- Oh, um, well, I'd say that it's not that high. Yeah. Tell the truth. You made him do odd jobs. <laughs> That's true. I have to evaluate you, fair- <clears throat> Mr. Kakuta. It, it's not like that. So until then, don't come here, okay? Well, the other employees and I were kind of aware that Mr. Ohira was a, a capable guy. <laughs> yeah. Then why were you saying that he's incompetent? Uh, well, if I evaluated him fairly, there'd be too much of a difference between him and the other employees. So I treated him like he couldn't work and called him that. Yeah. Uh, something like that. What the hell? What kind of reason is that? Understood? No, please! This is my fault too, but Mr. Ohira's the bad guy here! What? Why am I the bad guy? You were doing odd jobs by hiding the fact that you're competent! It's against the rules to do something like that, right? Wow. A dumb excuse. Hey, that doesn't spad to me. Part of it. I heard my daughter's voice when I was walking past the room, so I came. So, CEO, Mr. O what? The this isn't fair, Mr. Shindo! Uh huh? Hmm. <laughs> Answer him properly! Okay, understood. Then, Mr. Kakuta got suspended and was told to transfer to a local area. The department reviewed each employee's evaluation, and I was transferred to the elite strategic business department after receiving a fair evaluation. Another project you came up with has been accepted. The CEO was happy saying that if it goes well, it will expand our business even further. Really? I think I can do better, though. <laughs> Your work ethic is so different from before. Love it! At that time, I was called incompetent, so I wasn't that motivated. I was just a useless employee. Oh, um, I'm so sorry for, um, saying mean things to you before. No, no, please don't apologize. It was my fault, since I wasn't motivated. Anyways, I never knew how it's so refreshing to be appreciated by others. I, Hiroshi Ohira, will do my best from now on. <laughs> You're so simple-minded, but I'd like to see how far you could go if you give your all. Oh, really? Then should I try to take your father's spot? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> if you can, I would like to see that. Um... If that becomes true, um, can I be beside you? What? Oh, Mr. Shindo? Were you listening? Dad, stop it! Don't say it out loud! Ugh, so embarrassing! This is how I received the CEO's approval and my relationship with Kyoka began. I'd like to focus on my work even more to take the spot of becoming the CEO. Thank you for watching all the way till the end. Don't forget to subscribe and smash that like button. And if you have time, please check out our other videos as well. Alright then, see you next time. Bye!